The automotive industry in India is one of the largest in the world with an annual production of 23.96 million vehicles in FY fiscal year 2015-16, following a growth of 2.57% over the last year. The automobile industry accounts for 7.1% of the country's gross domestic product GDP. The two-wheelers segment, with 81% market share, is the leader of the Indian automobile market, owing to a growing middle class and a young population. Moreover, the growing interest of companies in exploring the rural markets further aided the growth of the sector. The overall passenger vehicle PV segment has 13% market share. India is also a prominent auto exporter and has strong export growth expectations for the near future. In FY 2014-15, automobile exports grew by 15% over the last year. In addition, several initiatives by the Government of India and the major automobile players in the Indian market are expected to make India a leader in the two-wheeler and four-wheeler market in the world by 2020. <laughs> market size Topic. The industry produced a total 14.25 million vehicles, including passenger vehicles PV, commercial vehicles CV, and three and two wheelers 3W and 2W, in April to October 2015, as against 13.83 in April to October 2014, registering a marginal growth of 3.07%, year to year. The sales of PVs grew by 8.51% in April to October 2015 over the same period in the previous year. The overall CV segment registered a growth of 8.02% in April to October 2015 as compared to same period last year. Medium and heavy commercial vehicles MCV and HCV registered very strong growth of 32.3%, while sales of light commercial vehicles LCV declined by 5.24% during April to October 2015, year to year. In April to October 2015, overall automobile exports grew by 5.78%. PVs, CVs, 3Ws, and 2Ws registered growth of 6.34%, 17.95%, 18.59%, and 3.22%, respectively, in April to October 2015, over April to October 2014. Topic. Investments. Topic. In order to keep up with the growing demand, several auto makers have started investing heavily in various segments of the industry during the last few months. The industry has attracted foreign direct investment FDI worth $17.4 billion during the period April 2000 to June 2017, according to data released by Department of Industrial Policy and Promotion DIP. Some of the major investments and developments in the automobile sector in India are as follows. Global automaker Ford plans to manufacture in India two families of engines by 2017, a 2.2-liter diesel engine code named Panther, and a 1.2-liter petrol engine code named Dragon, which are expected to power 270,000 Ford vehicles globally. The world's largest air bag suppliers Autolive Inc., Takata Corp., TRW Automotive Inc. and Toyota Gose Co. are setting up plants and increasing capacity in India. General Motors plans to invest $1 billion in India by 2020, mainly to increase the capacity at the Talagon plant in Maharashtra from 130,000 units a year to 220,000 by 2025. U.S.-based car maker Chrysler has planned to invest 3,500 crore rupees $525 million in Maharashtra, to manufacture Jeep Grand Cherokee model. Mercedes-Benz has decided to manufacture the GLA entry SUV in India. The company has doubled its India assembly capacity to 20,000 units per annum. Germany-based luxury car maker Bayerisch Motor & Work AG's BMW local unit has announced to procure components from seven India-based auto parts makers. Mahindra Two Wheelers Limited (MTWL) acquired 51% shares in France-based Peugeot Motorcycles (PMTC). Topic: Government initiatives. Topic: The Government of India encourages foreign investment in the automobile sector and allows 100% FDI under the automatic route. 
Some of the major initiatives taken by the Government of India are, the Government of India aims to make automobile manufacturing the main driver of Make in India initiative, as it expects the passenger vehicles market to triple to 9.4 million units by 2026, as highlighted in the Auto Mission Plan 2016-26. In the union budget of 2015-16, the government has announced plans to provide credit of 850,000 crore rupees, 127.5 billion dollars to farmers, which is expected to boost sales in the tractor segment. The government plans to promote eco-friendly cars in the country, i.e., CNG-based vehicles, hybrid vehicles, and electric vehicles, and also to make mandatory 5% ethanol blending in petrol. The government has formulated a scheme for faster adoption and manufacturing of electric and hybrid vehicles in India, under the National Electric Mobility Mission 2020, to encourage the progressive introduction of reliable, affordable, and efficient electric and hybrid vehicles into the country. The Automobile Mission Plan for the period 2006-2016, designed by the government is aimed at accelerating and sustaining growth in this sector. Also, the well-established regulatory framework under the Ministry of Shipping, Road Transport and Highways, plays a part in providing a boost to this sector. Topic History Topic In 1897, the first car ran on an Indian road. Through the 1930s, cars were imports only, and in small numbers. An embryonic automotive industry emerged in India in the 1940s. Hindustan Motors was launched in 1942, longtime competitor Premier in 1944, building Chrysler, Dodge, and Fiat products respectively. Mahindra and Mahindra was established by two brothers in 1945, and began assembly of Jeep CJ3A utility vehicles. Following independence in 1947, the Government of India and the private sector launched efforts to create an automotive component manufacturing industry to supply to the automobile industry. In 1953, an import substitution program was launched, and the import of fully built-up cars began to be restricted. 1947–1970 The 1952 Tariff Commission In 1952, the government appointed the first tariff commission, one of whose purposes was to come out with a feasibility plan for the indigenization of the Indian automobile industry. In 1953, the Commission submitted their report, which recommended categorizing existing Indian car companies according to their manufacturing infrastructure, with licensed capacity to manufacture a certain number of vehicles, with capacity increases allowable, as per demands, in the future. The Tariff Commission recommendations were implemented with new policies that would eventually exclude companies that only imported parts for assembly, as well as those with no Indian partner. In 1954, following the Tariff Commission implementation, General Motors, Ford, and Roots Group, which had assembly only plants in Mumbai, decided to move out of India. The Tariff Commission policies, including similar restrictions that applied to other industries, came to be known as the License Raj, which proved to be the greatest undoing of the Indian automotive industry, where bureaucratic red tape ended up causing demand to outstrip supply, with month long waiting periods for cars, scooters, and motorcycles. Passenger Cars Hindustan Motors, Calcutta, technical collaboration with Morris Motors to manufacture Morris Oxford models that would later become HM Ambassador. Addison's, an amalgamations group company, was the agent for Nuffield's Morris, Wolseley, and Riley Cars, and Chrysler's Plymouth, Dodge, and DeSoto Cars and Trucks. The first Morris Minor assembled in India and the first car assembled in Madras was driven out from Addison's twin plants on Smith Road by Ananthiramakrishnan on November 15, 1950. Premier Automobiles, Bombay, technical collaboration with Chrysler to manufacture Dodge, Plymouth and DeSoto models and with Fiat to manufacture the 1100D models which would later with Premier Padmini range. Standard Motor Products of India, Madras, technical collaboration from Standard Triumph to manufacture Standard Vanguard, Standard 8, 10 and later Standard Herald, utility and light commercial vehicles Vehicle Factory Jubalpur, started manufacturing Jonga light utility vehicles and Vahan 1 ton Nissan 4W73 carriers in India, under license from Nissan of Japan. They were the main troop carriers of the Indian Armed Forces and much powerful than any other vehicle of their class. Mahindra and Mahindra, Bombay, technical collaboration with Willys to manufacture CJ Series Jeep. Bajaj Tempo, Pune now Force Motors, technical collaboration with Tempo Company to manufacture Tempo Handseat, a three-wheeler and Tempo Viking and Hanomag, later known as Tempo Matador in India. 
Standard Motor Products of India, technical collaboration from Standard has license to manufacture the Standard Atlas passenger van with panel van and 1 ton 1 ton pickup variants, medium and heavy commercial vehicles vehicle factory Jubalpur, started manufacturing Shaktiman trucks with technical assistance from MAN SE of Germany. The trucks were the main logistics vehicle of the Indian Army with several specialist variants. VFJ still is the sole supplier of B vehicles to the Indian Armed Forces. Heavy Vehicles Factory, was established in 1965 in Avidai, near Chennai to produce tanks in India. Since its inception, HVF has produced all the tanks of India, including Vijayanta, Arjun, Ajaya, Bhishma and their variants for the Indian Army. HVF is the only tank manufacturing facility of India. Tata Motors, Pune, then known as Telco, technical collaboration with Mercedes-Benz to manufacture medium to heavy commercial vehicles both bus and trucks. Ashok Motors, later Ashok Leyland, Madras, technical collaboration with Leyland Motors to manufacture medium to heavy commercial vehicles both bus and trucks. Ashok Motors also discontinued its Austin venture formed in 1948 to sell Austin A40 and retooled the factory to make trucks and buses. Hindustan Motors, technical collaboration with General Motors to manufacture the Bedford range of medium lorry and bus chassis. Premier Automobiles, technical collaboration with Chrysler to manufacture the Dodge, Fargo range of medium lorry, panel vans, mini bus and bus chassis. Simpsons & Co., Madras, part of Amalgamations Group TAFE Tractors, technical collaboration with Ford to manufacture medium lorry and bus chassis, but did not utilize that option until the 1980s. Scooters, mopeds and motorcycles known as Bajaj Cheetok, by Bajaj became the largest sold scooter in the world Many of the two-wheelers manufacturers were granted licenses in the early 1960s, well after the Tariff Commission was enabled. Royal Enfield India, Madras, technical collaboration with Royal Enfield, UK to manufacture the Enfield Bullet range of motorcycles. Bajaj Auto, Pune, technical collaboration with Piaggio, Italy to manufacture their best-selling Vespa range of scooters and three-wheelers with commercial option as well. Automobile Products of India, Bombay, better known for API Lambretta, technical collaboration with Innocenti of Milan, Italy to manufacture their Lambretta range of mopeds, scooters and three-wheelers. This company was actually the Roots Group car plant that was bought over by M. H. Adambaram family. Mopeds India Limited, Tirupati, technical collaboration with Motobacane, France to manufacture their best-selling mobilette mopeds. Escorts Group, New Delhi, technical collaboration with CEKOP of Poland to manufacture the Rajdut 175 motorcycle whose origin was DKWRT 125 Ideal Jawa, Mysore, in technical collaboration with CZ, Jawa of Czechoslovakia for its Jawa and Yezdi range of motorcycles. 1970–1980 Topic. However, growth was relatively slow in the 1950s and 1960s, due to nationalization and the license Raj, hampering the growth of Indian private sector. The beginning of the 1970s saw some growth potential and most of the collaboration license agreements came to an end but with option to continue manufacturing with renewed branding. Cars were still meant for the elite and Jeeps were largely used by government organizations and some rural belts. In commercial vehicle segments some developments were made by the end of the decade to cater improved goods movements. The two-wheeler segment remained unchanged except for to increased sales in urban among middle class. But more Philip was target towards farm tractors as India was embarking on a new green revolution. More Russian and Eastern Bloc imports were done to increase the demand. But after 1970, with restrictions on the import of vehicles set, the automotive industry started to grow, but the growth was mainly driven by tractors, commercial vehicles and scooters. Cars still remained a major luxury item. In the 1970s, price controls were finally lifted, inserting a competitive element into the automobile market. However, by the 1980s, the automobile market was still dominated by Hindustan and Premier, who sold superannuated products in fairly limited numbers. During the 80s, a few competitors began to arrive on the scene. The OPEC oil crisis saw increased need to installing or redesign some vehicle to fit diesel engines on medium commercial vehicle. Until the early 1970s Mahindra Jeeps were on petrol and premier commercial vehicles had petrol model options. 
The defense sector too had most trucks on Pirtle engines. 1984–1990 from the end of the 1970s to the beginning of the 1980s saw no new models but the country continued with two decade-old designs forcing government to encourage and let more manufacturers into fray. In 1984, the then Prime Minister of India, Indira Gandhi established the Ordnance Factory Medak, near Hyderabad. It started manufacturing infantry combat vehicles christened as Sarath, the backbone of India's mechanised infantry. OFMK is still the only manufacturing facility of ICVs in India. To manufacture the high power engines used in ICVs and main battle tanks, engine factory Avidai, near Chennai was set in 1987. In 1986, to promote the auto industry, the government established the Delhi Auto Expo. The 1986 Expo was a showcase for how the Indian automotive industry was absorbing new technologies, promoting indigenous research and development, and adapting these technologies for the rugged conditions of India. The nine-day show was attended by then Prime Minister Rajiv Gandhi. Post-1992 liberalisation Eventually multinational automakers, such as, Suzuki and Toyota of Japan and Hyundai of South Korea, were allowed to invest in the Indian market, furthering the establishment of an automotive industry in India. Maruti Suzuki was the first, and the most successful of these new entries, and in part the result of government policies to promote the automotive industry beginning in the 1980s. As India began to liberalise its automobile market in 1991, a number of foreign firms also initiated joint ventures with existing Indian companies. The variety of options available to the consumer began to multiply in the 90s, whereas before there had usually only been one option in each price class. By 2000, there were 12 large automotive companies in the Indian market, most of them offshoots of global companies. Topic. Slow export growth. Topic. Exports were slow to grow. Sales of small numbers of vehicles to tertiary markets and neighboring countries began early, and in 1987 Maruti Suzuki shipped 480 cars to Europe Hungary. After some growth in the mid-90s, exports once again began to drop as the outmoded platforms provided to Indian manufacturers by multinationals were not competitive. This was not to last, and today India manufactures low-priced cars for markets across the globe. As of 18 March 2013, global brands such as Proton Holdings, PSA Group, Kia, Mazda, Chrysler, Dodge and Geely Holding Group were shelving plans for India due to the competitiveness of the market, as well as the global economic crisis. Emission norms in 2000, in line with international standards to reduce vehicular pollution, the central government unveiled standards titled, India 2000, with later, upgraded guidelines to be known as Bharat Stage Emission Standards. These standards are quite similar to the stringent European emission standards and have been implemented in a phased manner. Bharat Stage 4 BSIV, the most stringent so far, was implemented first, in April 2010, in 13 cities. Delhi NCR, Mumbai, Kolkata, Chennai, Bangalore, Hyderabad, Ahmedabad, Pune, Surat, Kanpur, Lucknow, Solapur, and Agra and then, as of April 2017, the rest of the nation. Topic. Local manufacture encouraged Topic. India levies an import tax of 125% on foreign imported cars, while the import tax on components such as gearboxes, airbags, drive axles, is 10%. Therefore, the taxes encourage cars to be assembled in India rather than be imported as completely built units. Manufacturing facilities The majority of India S car manufacturing industry is evenly divided into three clusters. Around Chennai is the southernmost and largest, with a 35% revenue share, accounting for 60% of the country. 
S Automotive Exports, and home of the operations of Heavy Vehicles Factory, Engine Factory Avidai, Ford, Hyundai, Renault, Mitsubishi, Nissan, BMW, Hindustan Motors, Daimler, Kaparo, Mini, and Datsun, near Mumbai, Maharashtra, along the Shakhan Corridor near Pune, is the Western Cluster, with a 33% share of the market. Audi, Volkswagen, and Skoda are located in Aurangabad. Mahindra and Mahindra has an SUV and engine assembly plant at Nashik. General Motors, Tata Motors, Mercedes-Benz, Land Rover, Jaguar, Fiat, and Force Motors have assembly plants in the area. The northern cluster is around the national capital region, and contributes 32%. Gurgaon and Manasar, in Haryana, are where the country's largest car manufacturer, Maruti Suzuki, is based. An emerging cluster is the state of Gujarat, with a manufacturing facility of General Motors in Halal, and a facility for Tata Nano at their plant in Sanand. Ford, Maruti Suzuki, and Peugeot Citroën plants are also planned for Gujarat, Kolkata with Hindustan Motors inactive, Noida with Honda, and Bengaluru with Toyota are other automotive manufacturing regions around the country. Topic Andhra Pradesh Topic Commercial and Passenger Vehicles Zuzuzu Motors India, in Sri City Kia Motors India, in Penukanda Ashok Leyland, in Krishna District Tutu Wheelers Hero Motorcorp, in Satyavaduaf Highway Vehicles Kabelko Cranes, in Sri City Topic Gujarat Topic Passenger Vehicles General Motors India Private Limited Chevrolet Sales India Private Limited, Halal Tata Motors, Sanan Ford India, Sanan Maruti Suzuki, Ahmedabad Commercial Vehicles Asia Motor Works AMW, Buj Topic Haryana Topic Two Wheeler Charlie Davidson India, Bawal Hero Motor Corp, Daruhera, Gurgaon Honda Motorcycle and Scooter India, Manasar India Yamaha Motor, Faridabad, Manasar Suzuki, Gurgaon Passenger Vehicles Maruti Suzuki, Gurgaon, Manasar Topic Himachal Pradesh Topic Two Wheelers TVS Motor, Nilagar Passenger Vehicles Zik ML Motors, Amp Commercial Vehicle Stafe Tractors, Parwano Topic Topic Jharkhand Topic Commercial Vehicle Stata Motors Jamshedpur Topic Karnataka Topic Two Wheelers TVS Motor Mysuru Honda Motorcycle and Scooter India Private Limited Narsapura Passenger Vehicles Mahindra Reva Electric Vehicles Bengaluru Toyota Kurloskar Motor Private Limited Bidadi Commercial Vehicles Bharat Earth Movers Bengaluru Scania Commercial Vehicles India Private Limited Bengaluru Tafe Tractors Dadabalapur Tata Motors Darwad Bharat Earth Movers Mysuru Volvo India Volvo Buses India Hosakote Volvo Trucks India Hosakote Volvo Construction Equipment India Hosakote Topic Kerala Topic Commercial Vehicles Bharat Earth Movers Defense Products, produces Tatra trucks 12x12, 10x10, 8x8, 6x6, 4x4, and variants Kerala Automobiles Limited Topic Madhya Pradesh Topic Two Wheelers Mahindra and Mahindra, Pithapur Commercial Vehicles Vehicle Factory Jubalpur, Jubalpur Iker Motors, Pithapur Hindustan Motors, Pithapur Force Motors Private Limited, Pithapur Tafe Tractors, Mandadeep John Deere Tractors, Diwas Case Construction Equipment, Pithapur Topic Maharashtra Topic Two Wheelers Bajaj Auto, Shakin, Pune and Waluj, Aurangabad KTM Sport Motorcycles, Shakin, Pune India Kawasaki Motors, Shakin, Pune Vespa Scooters, Baramati Kinetic Engineering, Ahmed Nagar DSK Hisong, Y Passenger Vehicles Mahindra and Mahindra Automotive Division, Nashik, Shakin, Pune Sangyong Motor Company, Shakin, Pune Tata Motors Limited Tata Motors, Pimpri Chinchwad, Pune Jaguar Cars, Pimpri Chinchwad, Pune Land Rover, Pimpri Chinchwad, Pune. Mercedes-Benz Passenger Cars, Shakin, Pune Fiat Automobiles, Ranjangan, Pune Jeep India, Ranjangan, Pune General Motors India, Talagan, Pune Volkswagen Group Sales India Private Limited Volkswagen, Shakin, Pune Skoda Auto, Shakin, Pune Audi AG, Shendra, Aurangabad Skoda Auto, Shendra, Aurangabad Chinkara Motors, Karlikhind, Alibag Premier Automobiles Limited, Pimpri Chinchwad, Pune Commercial Vehicle Sashak Leyland, Bandara Bajaj Auto, Waluj, Aurangabad Force Motors Motors, Shakin, Pune Mahindra Navistar, Shakin, Pune Man Trucks India, Akardi, Pune Piaggio Vehicles, Baramati Premier Automobiles Limited, Pimpri Chinchwad, Pune Iker, Ve Commercial Vehicles Limited, Thane. Sani India, Pune. Hyundai Construction Equipment, Shakin, Pune. Terex, Ked, Pune. Caterpillar, Banda. Topic Punjab Topic Commercial Vehicles ML Isuzu Limited, Nawanshahar, originally a Swaraj Mazda plant. Preet Tractor, Naba. Sonalika Tractor Private Limited, Hoshiarpur. 
Topic Rajasthan Topic 2 Wheeler Shonda Motorcycle and Scooter India Tapukara Passenger Vehicle Shonda Cars India Limited Tapukara Commercial Vehicle Sashak Leyland Alwar Tafe Tractors Alwar Topic Tamil Nadu Topic 2 Wheelers TVS Motor Hoser Royal Enfield Chennai India Yamaha Motor Oragadam Chennai Passenger Vehicles BMW India Mahindra World City New Chennai Ford India Private Limited Mary Malai Nagar Chennai Hyundai Motor India Limited Sriparumbador Chennai Chennai Mitsubishi, Tiravalor, Chennai Renault Nissan Automotive India Private Limited Nissan Motor India Private Limited, Oragadam, Chennai Renault India Private Limited, Oragadam, Chennai Commercial Vehicles Heavy Vehicles Factory, Avidai, Chennai Engine Factory Avidai, Avidai, Chennai Ashok Leyland, Enora Chennai, Hoser Bharatbenz, Oragadam, Chennai Kamaz Vectra Motors, Hoser Same Dutes Far Tractors, Renipet, Velour Tafe Tractors, Chennai TVs Motor, Hoser Topic Telangana Topic Defense Ordnance Factory Factory Medak, Medic Commercial Vehicles Mahindra and Mahindra, Zahirabad Topic Uttar Pradesh Topic Two Wheeler Sindhya Yamaha Motor, Greater Noida LML, Kanpur Passenger Vehicle Shonda Cars India Limited Greater Noida JS Auto P Limited Camper Commercial Vehicle Stata Motors Lucknow Topic Uttarakhand Topic Commercial Vehicle Sashak Leyland Pantnagar Tata Motors Pantnagar Mahindra and Mahindra Haridwar Two Wheelers Hero Motor Corp Haridwar Bajaj Auto Pantnagar Topic West Bengal Topic Passenger Vehicles Hindustan Motors Limited Kolkata Inactive Commercial Vehicle Stata Hitachi Construction Machinery Karagpur Topic Exports Topic India's automobile exports have grown consistently and reached 4.5 billion in 2009, with the United Kingdom being India's largest export market, followed by Italy, Germany, Netherlands, and South Africa. According to the New York Times, India's strong engineering base and expertise in the manufacturing of low-cost, fuel-efficient cars has resulted in the expansion of manufacturing facilities of several automobile companies like Hyundai, Nissan, Toyota, Volkswagen, and Maruti Suzuki. In 2008, South Korean multinational Hyundai Motors alone exported 240,000 cars made in India. Nissan Motors plans to export 250,000 vehicles manufactured in its India plant by 2011. Similarly, U.S. automobile company, General Motors announced its plans to export about 50,000 cars manufactured in India by 2011. In September 2009, Ford Motors announced its plans to set up a plant in India with an annual capacity of 250,000 cars, for $500 million. The cars will be manufactured both for the Indian market and for export. The company said that the plant was a part of its plan to make India the hub for its global production business. Fiat Motors announced that it would source more than $1 billion worth auto components from India. In 2009 India 0 .23 meters surpassed China 0 .16 meters as Asia's fourth largest exporter of cars after Japan 1 .77 meters, Korea 1 .12 meters, and Thailand 0 .26 meters. .In July 2010, the Economic Times reported that PSA Peugeot Citroën was planning to re-enter the Indian market and open a production plant in Andhra Pradesh that would have an annual capacity of 100,000 vehicles, investing 700 million euros in the operation. PSA's intention to utilize this production facility for export purposes however remains unclear as of December 2010. In recent years, India has emerged as a leading center for the manufacture of small cars. Hyundai, the biggest exporter from the country, now ships more than 250,000 cars annually from India. Apart from Maruti Exports shipments to Suzuki's other markets, Maruti Suzuki also manufactures small cars for Nissan, which sells them in Europe. Nissan will also export small cars from its new Indian assembly line. Tata Motors exports its passenger vehicles to Asian and African markets, and is preparing to sell electric cars in Europe in 2010. The firm is planning to sell an electric version of its affordable car the Tata Nano in Europe and in the US Mahindra and Mahindra is preparing to introduce its pickup trucks and small SUV models in the US market. Bajaj Auto is designing a low-cost car for Renault-Nissan Automotive India, which will market the product worldwide. Renault-Nissan may also join domestic commercial vehicle manufacturer Ashok Leyland in another small car project. While the possibilities for the Indian automobile industry are impressive, there are challenges that could thwart future growth. Since the demand for automobiles in recent years is directly linked to overall economic expansion and rising personal incomes, industry growth will slow if the economy weakens. 
Topic Top 10 Export Destinations Topic India exported $14.5 billion worth of automobiles in 2014. The 10 countries below imported 47.8% of that total. Topic passenger vehicles in India Topic This list is of cars that are officially available and serviced in India. While other cars can be imported to the country at a steep 105% import duty, car makers such as Alfa Romeo, McLaren, Pagani, Cadillac, Chrysler, SSC, Lincoln, Zenvo, Seat, Smart, Daihatsu, Infiniti, Acura, Saab, Spiker, Lotus, Ariel, Caterham, Peugeot Citroën, Mazda, Kia, Gaz, and Proton are in various stages of official introduction into the Indian automobile industry. Topic Indian Automotive Companies Topic Topic Models currently manufactured by Indian companies Topic Chinkara Motors, Beechster, Hammer, Roadster 1. 8S, Rockster, Jeepster, Sailster Force Motors earlier known as Tempo, 1 Hindustan Motors, Ambassador Haradiyash, Morris Street ICML, Rhino RX Mahindra, Bolero, Scorpio, Thar, Xylo, Quanto, Verito, Verito Vibe, Genio, XUV500, E20, TUV300, KUV100, Nuvosport. Premier Automobiles Limited, Sigma, Rio San Motors, Storm Maruti Suzuki, subsidiary of Japanese automaker Suzuki, Alto K10, Alto 800, Wagon R, Swift, Desire, Omni, EECO, Gypsy, Erdiga, Solario, Siaz, Vitara Brezza, Beleno, Ignis, S Cross. Tata Motors, Nano, Sumo, Movis, Venture, Safari, Xenon, Zest, Bolt, Chiagu, Tigor, Hexa, Nexon. Topic defunct Indian Automotive Companies Topic Sipani Automobiles Standard Motor Products of India Topic Foreign Automotive Companies in India Topic Hyundai, Renault, Nissan, Datsun, Mitsubishi, Ford, Fiat, Honda, Toyota, Volkswagen, Skoda, Audi, Jaguar, Land Rover, Mercedes-Benz, BMW and Mini are the foreign automotive companies that manufacture and market their products in India. Topic vehicles currently manufactured or assembled in India Topic Audi India, A3, A4, A6, A8, Q3, Q5, Q7. BMW India, 1 Series, 3 Series, 3 Series GT, 5 Series, 7 Series, X1, X3, X5. Datsun, Go, Go Plus, Ready Go Fiat India, Punto, Linea, Aventura, Urban Cross. Ford India, Figo, Figo Aspire, Freestyle, Ecosport, Endeavor. Honda Cars India Limited, Brio, Jazz, Amaze, BRV, City, WRV. Hyundai Motor India, Eon, I-10, I-20, Accent, Verna, Elantra, Creta, Tucson. Isuzu, Mu7, V-Cross. Jaguar, subsidiary of Tata Motors, Z, XF, XJ. Jeep India, Compass. Land Rover subsidiary of Tata Motors, Discovery Sport, Range Rover Evoque. Mercedes-Benz India, A-Class, C-Class, E-Class, GLA-Class, GLE-Class, GLC-Class, S-Class. Mini, Countryman. Mitsubishi in collaboration with Hindustan Motors, Pajaro. Nissan Motor India, Micra, Sunny, Toronto. Renault India, Capture, Duster, Quid, Laji, Skoda Auto India, Rapid, Octavia, Superb, Kodiak. Toyota Kurloscar, Etios Leva, Etios, Corolla Altus, Innova Crista, Fortuner, Camry. Volkswagen India, Polo, Vento, AMEO, Tiguan, Passat, Opel was present in India until 2006. As of 2013, Opel only provides spare parts and vehicle servicing to existing Opel vehicle owners. Topic vehicles currently imported into India Topic Aston Martin, Vantage, Vanquish, Rapide, Virage, DB9, DBS, 177. Audi, A8L, A7, A5, TT, 6 Rupees Avant, R8. Bentley, Arnage, Azure, Brooklands, Continental GT, Continental Flying Spur, Mulsanne. BMW, 5 Series GT, 6 Series, 7 Series, X5M, X6, X6M, M3, M5, M6 and Z4. Bugatti, Veyron. Ferrari, California, 458 Italia F12, FF. Fiat, Abarth 595 Competizone Ford, Mustang. General Motors, Hummer H2, Hummer H3. Gumpert, Apollo. Honda, Accord Hybrid. Jaguar, subsidiary of Tata Motors, XK, F-Type Koenigsegg, CCX, CCXR, Agera. 
Lamborghini, Huracan, Aventador. Land Rover subsidiary of Tata Motors, Discovery 4, Range Rover Veeler, Range Rover Sport, Range Rover. Maserati, Quattroporte, Ghibli. Mercedes-Benz, Viano. Mini, Cooper, Cooper S, Convertible. Mitsubishi, Montero. Nissan, GTR. Porsche, 997, Boxster, Panamera, Cayman, Cayenne, Carrera GT, Mackin. Rolls-Royce, Ghost, Wraith, Phantom, Phantom Coupe, Phantom Drophead Coupe. Sangyong, subsidiary of Mahindra and Mahindra, Rexton. Toyota, Land Cruiser, Land Cruiser Prado, Prius. Volkswagen, Beetle. Volvo, V40, V90, S60, S90, XC60, XC90. Topic commercial vehicle manufacturers in India Topic Topic Indian brands Topic AMW Iker Motors Force Hindustan Motors Mahindra and Mahindra Premier Tata Motors Hero Motorcorp Jaguar Land Rover Bajaj Auto TVs Motor Topic Joint Venture JV brands Topic Ashok Leyland, originally a JV between Ashok Motors owned by the Hinduja Group and Leyland Motors, now joint ventures between Ashok Leyland and Nissan Motors Japan for LCVs, and John Deere USA for construction equipment. Kamaz Vectra, a JV between Russia's Kamaz and the Vectra Group Man Force, a JV between Force Motors and Manag Germany SML Isuzu, originally, as Swaraj Mazda, a JV between Punjab Tractors and Mazda, now 53.5% owned by Sumitomo Group and with its current name since 2011. Tatra Vectra Motors Limited defunct initial truck partnership with India by Vectra. Replaced by Kamaz. Tatra trucks for sale in India are now manufactured in collaboration with Bharat Earth Movers Limited. VE Commercial Vehicles Limited, VE Commercial Vehicles Limited, a JV between Volvo Group and Iker Motors Limited. Maruti Suzuki, a joint venture of Indian Maruti and Japanese Suzuki. Topic foreign owned brands topic JC Bamford, JCB, owned by British multinational corporation JC Bamford. Barat Benz owned by Daimler AG of Germany and affiliated with Daimler's Fuso and Mercedes-Benz brands Caterpillar Inc. Doff Hino Isuzu Iveco Man Mercedes-Benz, manufactures luxury coaches in India. Piaggio Rosenbauer. Scania Tatra. Volvo. Topic electric vehicle and hybrid vehicle XEV industry topic During April 2012, the Indian government planned to unveil the roadmap for the development of domestic electric and hybrid vehicles XEV in the country. A discussion between the various stakeholders, including government, industry, and academia, was expected to take place during 23-24 February. The final contours of the policy would have been formed after this set of discussions. Ministries such as petroleum, finance, road transport, and power are involved in developing a broad framework for the sector. Along with these ministries, auto industry executives, such as Anand Mahindra Vice Chairman and Managing Director, Mahindra and & Mahindra and Vikram Kurloskar Vice Chairman, Toyota Kurloskar, were involved in this task. The government has also proposed to set up a 740 crore rupees research and development fund for the sector in the 12th five-year plan during 2012-17. The idea is to reduce the high cost of key imported components such as the battery and electric motor, and to develop such capabilities locally. In the year 2017, an Amaravati, Andhra Pradesh-based electric vehicles manufacturing company called Avera New and Renewable Energy started electric scooters manufacturing and are ready to launch their two models of scooters by the end of December 2018. Topic electric car manufacturers in India Topic Ajanta Group. Hero Electric. Mahindra, Reva, now Mahindra Reva Electric Vehicles. Terra International. Tata Motors. Topic driverless technology in India Topic While there is controversy on possibility of driverless cars in India, many startups are working on this technology. Flux Auto Fishibox High Tech Robotic Systems Atimotors Netradine Swayat Robots Oro Robotics Omnipresent Robotics Cedrica 1.0 In Auto Expo 2018, High Tech Robotic Systems launched an artificial intelligence based driver behavior sensor technology called Novus Aware in partnership with Daimler India Commercial Vehicles. DIC V. Topic defunct motor vehicle manufacturers of India Topic Automobile Products of India or API, founded in 1949 at Bombay now Mumbai, by the British company Roots Group, and later bought by M. A. Chidambaram of the Mac Group from Madras now Chennai. 
The company manufactured Lambretta scooters, API three-wheelers under license from Innocenti of Italy and automobile ancillaries, notably clutch and braking systems. API's registered offices were earlier in Mumbai, later shifted to Chennai, in Tamil Nadu. The manufacturing facilities were located in Mumbai and Aurangabad in Maharashtra and in Ambattur, Chennai. The company has not been operational since 2002. Escorts Yamaha, in 1984 Escorts formed a joint venture with Yamaha to manufacture motorcycles. In 2008 became India Yamaha Motor. Hero Motors is a former moped and scooter manufacturer based in Delhi, India. It is a part of multinational company Hero Group, which also currently owns Hero Motorcorp, formerly Hero Honda and Hero Cycles, among others. Hero Motors was started in the 1960s to manufacture 50cc two-stroke mopeds but gradually diversified into making larger mopeds, mokicks and scooters in the 1980s and the 1990s. Noteworthy collaborators and technical partners were Pooch of Austria and Malaguti of Italy. Due to tightening emission regulations and poor sales, Hero Motors have discontinued the manufacture of all gasoline-powered vehicles and transformed itself into an electric two-wheeler and auto parts manufacturer. Ideal Jawa, motorcycle company based in Mysore, sold licensed Jawa and – motorcycles beginning in 1960 under the brand name Jawa and later Yezdi. Kinetic Honda, a joint venture between Kinetic Engineering Limited, India and Honda Motor Company, Japan. The joint venture operated during 1984 to 1998, manufacturing two-stroke scooters in India. In 1998, the joint venture was terminated after which Kinetic Engineering continued to sell the models under the brand name Kinetic until 2008 when the interests were sold to Mahindra. Mopeds India Limited produces the Suvega range of mopeds under technical collaboration with Motobacane of France. Standard, produced by Standard Motor Products in Madras from 1949 to 1988. Indian standards were variations of vehicles made in the UK by Standard Triumph. Standard Motor Products of India Limited SMPI, was incorporated in 1948, and their first product was the Vanguard, which began to be assembled in 1949. The company was dissolved in 2006 and the old plant torn down. Topic Automotive Research Association of India Standards Topic The Government of India felt the need for a permanent agency to expedite the publication of standards and development of test facilities in parallel with the work of the preparation of the standards, as the development of improved safety critical parts could be undertaken only after the publication of the standard and commissioning of test facilities. The Ministry of Surface Transport most constituted a Permanent Automotive Industry Standards Committee AISC. The standards prepared by AISC will be approved by the Permanent CMVR Technical Standing Committee After approval, the Automotive Research Association of India will publish this standard. Intelligent Transport Systems are globally proven systems to optimize the utilization of existing transport infrastructure and improve transportation systems in terms of efficiency, quality, comfort and safety. Having realized the potential of its, government bodies and other organizations in India are presently working towards implementing various components of its across the country. The first step taken for creation and implementation of its was holding a national workshop titled User Requirements for Interactive ITS Architecture, which was conducted as a collaboration between SIAM and ASRTU on 26 and 27 February 2015. This was primarily focused on ITS in public bus transportation. Nonetheless, the workshop helped to create the outline for National Intelligent Transport System Architecture and Policy for Public Transport bus, which was submitted by ASRTU and SIAM to the government in the 44th and 45th CMVRTSC. Chairman had directed, standardization activities to be initiated on intelligent transportation systems its vehicle location tracking, camera surveillance system and emergency request button. The committee intended to extend the above user requirements to all public transportation namely buses, taxis, etc. The current document covers the requirements for vehicle location tracking and emergency button. The other ITS components like PIS, CCTV system, fare collection etc. are deliberated and would be addressed in later phase and could be added as separate parts to the current document. Based on these directions, the AISC panel on ITS has prepared this ICE 140 titled, Intelligent Transportation Systems requirements for public transport vehicle operation. 
The panel also deliberated and identified the necessary elements for an effective implementation of vehicle level its system. For ICE 140 devices, in India, connectivity to report location, an emergency panic button signal is though wireless cellular connectivity. There are device-focused cellular connectivity offerings like eSIM 4 things available in India, which cater to connectivity requirements of ICE 140 devices. eSIM 4 things is fully compatible with all ICE 140 devices and with a connectivity manager and a range of tariff plans. Topic see also topic Media related to automobile manufacturers of India at Wikimedia Commons Automobile industry Automotive industry standards, the automotive regulations of India Electric vehicle industry in India Electronics and semiconductor manufacturing industry in India Lists of automobile related articles List of car brands List of truck manufacturers List of motorcycle manufacturers category, List of scooters List of scooter manufacturers List of countries by motor vehicle production List of countries by vehicle Vehicles per capita List of Asian cars List of automobile manufacturers of China List of Japanese cars List of vehicle plants in India Topic References Topic, topic Bibliography Topic Gupta, Sadanand 2012, Automobile Industry in India, A Cluster Approach, Ruby Press & Co., ISBN 978-81-922182-6-7 Kamala, T. N. and Doraswamy, A. G. 2007. Strategies for Enhancing Competitiveness of Indian Auto Component Industries. Indian Institute of Management Cori Code. Piply, Tapas the 28th of July 2001. Automobile Industry, Shifting Strategic Focus. Economic and Political Weekly. Mumbai, India, Samiksha Trust. 36-30-2892-2897. Tiku, Pran 2008. Six Sizzling Markets, How to Profit from Investing in Brazil, Russia, India, China, South Korea, and Mexico. John Wiley & Sons. ISBN 978-0-470-17888-1.